Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I will be playing Voxel Doom 2, map 24, The Chasm. Attempt number 1, The Chasm. This map, and you know, since we also have the Red Race Doom 2, I think it's a good idea to play the original version first, and then to play the Red Race version to see what are the changes. So let's go, first I want to get the shotgun over here. And there will be quite a lot of cacos. Well, not that many, maybe two or four. Three, actually. And then I want to leave, and in the meantime, I want these imps to get out of this section because I want the rocket launcher. So I will go back and we'll try to get the BFG. It should be right over here, let's not forget to grab the rockets. Then I will jump down, grab the radiation suit. And then we'll take my time killing this Hell Knight. Like this, then let's grab the BOG and more shells. And now I want to shoot these pinkies. Come on. And I think a few more left, somewhere here. Like two or three. Right, then we can grab another radiation suit, just in case. And now we can move on. Let's not forget to grab these shells as well. And then I will go around and grab these shells. And now we can take this teleporter and we telefrag the caco, which is perfect. So now we can go and safely grab the rocket launcher. Over here. And now it's time to kill all the imps wandering around. Like this. Right, and let's actually use the rocket launcher here as well. Right, and while we're still here, let's go grab the secrets over here. Should be like one rocket, box of shells. And then let's go through the door over here and grab more rockets, which we might need. Right here. Nice. Then there was a caco. Why didn't you die? And I think that's it. So now we can move on to the next section. I think we go here to the bit of water. And now we can go to the very dark room. Over here. Right, and I will prepare the rocket launcher because I want to kill this Baron quickly. Like this. Then let's grab the Berserk pack, press the switch, and then I want to use this one BFG shot to kill all the chain gunners here. Because they're quite dangerous. Right, next, since we have the Berserk pack, we can start killing the pinkies here. And the specters. I will punch them, why not? It's fun. Or maybe we can use some rockets. Three rockets is enough, because I need the rockets for the next room as well. Come on. A few more. I think one or two more left. And let's grab the chain guns. I'm already full of ammo. That's fine. Then we have health here. Let's press the switch to unlock the exit. And now this room. I will rocket everything. Some of the pinkies, of course, will teleport out. But that's fine, we can just punch them. And then I want to press the switch, because it most likely rides the stairs. There's the next section where we can get the super shotgun, I think. Let's see. I'm not sure, but I think these stairs appeared when you press the switch. Right, let's go grab this super shotgun and kill all the imps. It's okay to take damage here because we're going to get the Mega Sphere pretty soon. Right. Then here we have another imp, let's punch him. And I think a few more here. Right, and now comes the barons. Let's just rocket them. 
or what I'm saying, not barons, but uh, Hell Knights. And I missed the rockets. Right, then, next nice section. Let's kill the imps here. And there should be quite a lot of chain gunners here, right? Yeah. Some imps and more chain gunners. Actually, I should have saved some rockets because there will be quite a lot more after I leave this room. Like here. Oh no, we don't. Right. Let's actually use the chain gun since we're getting a lot of chain gun ammo. Chain gun slaughter. Right. Then I think that's it. Let's not forget about the secret over here, with some more rockets. I could have used these rockets against the Hell Knights. Right, and now we get the Megasphere. And also this level has really nice music as well. Right, let's go grab the Bucky. And kill all the aims here. Double kill? No. Right, and I think a few here. And I usually forget some of the imps in this room, so I need to be carefully looking around for the imps. And maybe punch some of them. Not that I need to save shells at ammo, but it's fun. Especially when the jeep like this. Right. And I hope that's it for this room. Then we can move on. Right, next uh, through the blue door we go. Over here, and now we have the plasma. Let's grab cells here. And here should be the plasma. Right, and then I will not wait until this plasma will rise. We'll just go here, grab the cells. And we'll just move on to the next section. And if you take this teleporter... We will be right on the top of this ledge, so we can snipe the, some of the lost souls. And maybe shoot some rockets to the Kakos. Oh uh, no. It's a bit tricky to navigate here. Come on, I want to kill these guys. Nice. And then, there will be pretty useless secret. It's a... Uh, Invincibility, but if you press the invisible switch over here, you can rise the wall. Actually, you can rise it a bit higher than the normal level here. And then we can jump a bit earlier from this platform, and I fell down. Right. Let's take the teleporter again. As I said, a bit useless secret because you are wasting your invincibility in the meantime. And I failed the jump again. That's fine, I can just rise the platform like this. And then let's go here. There will be one more Kakma. And then I want to grab the backpack. And now let's kill these Kakos as well. Because they're annoying. And you, I will super shotgun. Right. Then we can just prepare the chain gun and move on. And here there will be quite a lot of plus souls. So I want to go here first. And I can safely chain gun them. Because they cannot get to me. The items on the floor will not allow that. Nice. And I have quite a lot of cells, which will be really useful in the next room. So we can kill some of the pinkies. Like this. Maybe punch the rest. Come on. Right, one left. Then let's press the switch and release some more pinkies. And I will just super shotgun them. Right. And then when we press this switch, there will be a lot more pinkies. So I want to lure them out first. And BFG. Right. And actually it's good that I saved some of the shells because I'm now running out of them. Right, then next, let's repeat the sequence to get the red key.
Right, and now four pinkies left here. No, we don't. Go away. And now we have the red key, so we can exit, but we still have one section to complete. Because there are some enemies there. So let's see if I go here. Then let's grab the remaining radiation suit. To make it a bit faster. So then I go here and take the teleporter again. And I have one spare radiation suit, just in case. And I don't remember if I grabbed that one on the top here. But actually it doesn't matter. So right, next we go here. We can grab uh, rockets here, some more shells, and now comes this section. I think there should be like a few Hell Knights or so. And then a few months go by. Probably. And I don't need the Berserk Park right now. Ah, uh, no. And there should be quite a few pinkies behind you if you press this switch here. Or computer panel. And I think that should be it, basically. Maybe one of the soul somewhere. Which we also need to kill because this is a GZ Doom and the souls are counts towards the kill count. And again, if you go here, you don't want to go straight forward because there is a teleporter here. So we just go around. And now we're done. Right. And I think that's it. Let's check the stats. We have one kill left. It's probably one of the Kakos that I forgot to kill in the outside area. Let's see. Maybe somewhere here. Or maybe it's Lost Soul in the final room. Let's actually go and check the final room. Because I don't hear anything here. Yeah, now I hear something. Where was it again? Yeah. Something is here. It's definitely Lost Soul. You. Can you die? Nice, now we got all the kills and all the secrets. So now we need to exit. But of course, you don't want to fall down. And now we need to go around again, so let's actually go here. Take the shortcut. Right. Like this, and now comes the most tricky part of the level. And you really don't want to fall down here because it's an inescapable pit, so we cannot get out. Like this. Nice. And we got everything. Perfect. Let's go. Right. Now we have the Ray Traced version of this level, and it looks really cool already. Especially those green slime waterfalls. And I think we can even see through them. We will figure out later. But for now, I want to get some weapons first. So as usual, I will go for the shotgun. And it's really dark in here. So the imp's fireballs just lighting up the room. Right, so let's wake up the cacos. Then hopefully make them in fight with the imps. And in the meantime, as usual, I will go for the PFG. And this Kako is stuck here, as always. Right, let's be quick. Grab the radiation suit. Some shells, and now I want to kill the Hell Knight, as usual. Then grab the BFG, and actually let's BFG those pickies. Because it's faster. Just to speed up the process. Let's grab the rockets, the bullets, and the shells. And now let's just move on. So now we're here and I don't see any imps on the platform, so now we can safely grab the rocket launcher. Like this. 
And all the stuff just moved over there so we can just rocket everything. Uh, no. Come on. Let's get some rockets, shall we? Over here. And now let's not forget about the secret as well. Because we have some more shells here and one rocket. Which is also nice to have. And now I think it's time to go for the Berserk Pack. Over here. Right, then this room. It also feels a bit darker than the original one. So let's blow up the Hell Knight as usual. Grab the Berserk Pack, and now I don't have any cells left, so I have to rocket these chain gunners. Hopefully kill them all. Yeah, like this. It's quite dangerous here. Right, then goes the pinkies and the specters. Come on. I could have used some rockets, but I need them for the next room, because I don't have any cells anymore. Right. Then let's press the switch to unlock the exit. And I don't remember if I pressed this switch. Let's see. Yes, I did. Not sure what it does. And then uh, this room. Let's prepare the rocket launcher. Kill everything. Perfect. And one pinky escaped. That's fine. Let's press the switch and look at this lighting. Looks really cool. Right, let's move on. Then we got everything here, so we can just go to the next section. And this Kako, I forgot about him. Maybe that one that was hiding in the corner over here. Yeah. Let's kill you. Where did you go? I will deal with you later, so let's just go here. Grab the super shotgun and kill all the aims. Uh, no. Some imps behind me. And probably Kako as well, so I need to be careful. Double kill, yes. And I think I've seen a Kako, yeah. Come on, die already. Thank you. Next, let's not forget about the secret rockets here, because we will need them for the upcoming Hell Knights. And also some health. And look like this armor bonus is lighting up the room. Cool. Right, let's press the switch, prepare the rocket launcher and rocket the Hell Knights. Nice. And let's not forget about these imps. And now it's time for the chain gunners. Over here. One more. Now we can grab the bullets. And let's not forget about these chain gunners, because I usually do. And let's try to blow up the rest. Nice. And I think a few more, maybe. Some more here. And I hear more here, yeah. And that should be it. I hope. Then let's grab the Megasphere. And now we can move on to the Slime Waterfalls room. I think it's the coolest place in this level. So yes, now we have the Super Shotgun and kill all the imps. And look at them, I can see the Kako. Right. These balls look like a glass slime. So now we have the blue key. And I can see all the imps behind the walls. Really cool. Right, and I think one imp left here. And that should be it. 
don't see a thing. Yeah, that should be it. Hopefully. Then we can just move on to the blue door. And as always, we will go for the plasma first. Jump now for the radiation suit. Grab the cells and we'll move on to this section. And in the meantime, we can also grab another radiation suit, grab the invincibility and rise the platform up. And I fell down. Alright. Then I will have to wait for a bit. It's a bit too bright. This is effect. And this is how you waste the invincibility. Come on. Let me out, and you should go. Right, I don't think that's it. Let's maybe chain gun this blue soul. And you know what? Let's go for this section first. For the second megasphere. Let's grab a few rockets first. Then, the souls. Here you are. And now we can move on. And it's really dark here. Compared to the original version. So, first go the Hell Knights. Then goes the Mancubus, or Mancubai. And finally the pinkies. Over here. And actually, let's punch the rest of the pinkies. This is also a pretty cool looking room. Those are the lights from the ceiling. Right, and uh, now we can grab the second supercharge. But let's kill this last soul first. Let's grab it, why not? I don't know I'm wasting it, but that's okay. There's nothing serious left in this level except of these tiny ledges, of course. There will be a cuckoo here. Let's see, carefully go for the backpack. Right, so let's kill you. And then we'll go to the last room. So let's prepare the chain gun. And now we move on over here to get rid of all of these lost souls. They're quite annoying. Right. I will snipe you with normal shotgun. Right, then, next room. Room full of pinkies. Let's see. Let's actually kill some of them with a super shotgun. Then I will punch the rest. And I still have cells. I can use them for the upcoming pinkies as well. Right. And this room is also really cool. Like the water on the ceiling. Well, I would say the level is perceived completely differently with these lighting effects. Because I do remember this room was a bit ugly. Right then, the pinkies. Now I need the BFG. That's good enough. Let's press the switches again. To grab the red key. And now four pink is left and then we can leave. And this should be the last enemies, I think. Let's see. Yeah, now we're done. So now we have to complete this section to reach the exit. Uh, no. If you fell outside, I think you are done. But if you fell inside, it's still possible to recover. But I don't want to check it out. Right. Then we got everything. Let's go. 
That was part 10 of Doom 2 series, and I think I will stick to this format for the rest of the levels, playing one level on the classic engine and one level on the ray traced engine, to see what is the difference. See you in part 11.